premiere for this film. Just talk about being able to premiere it here and being a part of it. Oh, I love the Toronto Film Festival. My very first festival experience was here, actually, with a movie called Martha Marcy May Marlene, and then 12 Years a Slave I came here with, and so it feels like a great, a great um, home away from home as far as festivals go. It's always an incredibly warm reception, and I feel like a lot of real um, avid moviegoers who love, you know, seeing something for the first time. Now, you were a lot of fun in this movie. Oh, yeah. Uh, have you had a chance to see the I have thing? not. No. No, no, no. Well, I can tell you it's pretty spectacular. Oh, good. Good, good, good. I'm so glad. So, um, talk about working with female production team, female director, and this really strong female character. Female characters all around. Well, God, I mean, uh, I, I wish it weren't as rare uh, as it is. And... Um, I don't know. To, to me, it's hard for me to talk about in a in a supremely unique way because I feel where I have been working for a long time has been so uh, women centric and uh, stories of, of women, women over forty, sort of at the front and center and heart of all of these stories. So I have felt so uniquely supported in that way uh, in the environment I've been working in. So this didn't feel entirely new to me, but. Uh, what was sort of interesting was like not only was the, were the characters and the narrative uh, female centric, but everybody behind the scenes were as well. And I thought I think that was a really um, extraordinary thing and very empowering. And as I've always been very happy to be a woman, it was a nice a nice thing to look around the room and see women everywhere. Thank you yeah. so much. Thank you. I appreciate it.